Hey, what's up, my Neeks? This is Tommy Train, all the way back again with another video with Nerds of the Square Table. And we're here at HTCE, which is Hawaii Toy Com I mean, yeah, oh no, Comics, HTTE. Hawaii Comic Book and Toy Expo. Sorry, I got it. I got it wrong on that one. But anyways, uh, we're just we're just heading to the floor right now, and we're checking out all these vendors. There's a lot of cool stuff out here. It is packed. It is packed. Or it was packed earlier too, but it's still kind of packed. So to me. So yeah. So so what what would you say? Uh, what year did we come to this? Um. I yeah. forgot when the last time I went to one of these. But, yeah. Uh, it was like it was a couple of years ago. It's it was like in a smaller room too. So hey, it's growing. Yeah. It's it been is growing. Uh, I think they're on. I don't know when they're on. What year they're on? Maybe third, fourth, third, fourth year. This is. I think this is like the fourth annual or the fifth annual. Like I've skipped a couple, but I remember the first time. Remember we went to the first show. The first show. And that was like super exciting. Yeah. I mean, hey, if you like, they only was, had that outside. Yeah, they only had the outside, but yeah. then you know what? It was it was magical. And now, like, look, there's a bunch of vendors. Like, you know what they had last time too was uh, gaming. They had like some NES. Oh no, that was only one vendor though. That was only one one, one vendor had had like this uh, gaming console, yeah. NES console, and they were playing and stuff. But you got to try out stuff. But yeah, if, if you do live in uh, Hawaii, yeah, uh, definitely. If you're into this kind of stuff, like toys, comics. Definitely, yeah, it's yeah, yeah, uh, down here. I, just, I, I got the name wrong. Dude, if you're watching this channel, you better be here. <laughs> yeah, if you're yeah. watching this channel, you you're bored, you're here already. You, like, you pay your $3 and then you come in and you nerd out with everybody. But yeah, but basically, we're just gonna walk around. We're just gonna walk around and we're gonna just, uh, you know, just have this camera rolling, right? Yep. Check out some cool stuff. Check it out. Let's check it out. So this is, this is our vlog. We got epic music playing in the background. We got some cool stuff over here. We got some collectibles, you know. Like what we got over here. Look, Beyblades. Beyblades. Like Beyblade style. Thomas the Train. Thomas Train style. Like anything for your for your collector needs. Um, okay. We're gonna go. Yeah. We got Hot Wheels too. Anything. Anything that that has to do with being being a geek. So. Uh, hold on one moment. I'm gonna pause the video. And no shames. Okay, so Gregatron just found something pretty interesting. Gregatron, what have you found? We got old school Pokemon cards. Like old school. Super old school. Yeah. And how you can tell they're old school is uh, usually on the American version on the bottom, it's gonna say 1995 Nintendo. So it says 1995, 1996, uh, 97, 99 Nintendo. And it says Game Freak, 99 Wizards. So that's kind of like how you can tell through through some of it. It's always on the bottom. The Japanese version, though, the Japanese version for uh, Pokemon doesn't really have have any dates or whatnot. They will say who is who the illustrator was or whatnot. And Aside from like collecting Pokemon, I think I actually played the game. No, yeah, I played the game a couple times. times. Yeah, a couple times, not too much. But but you gotta admit, was it balanced? No. Exactly. Uh, it was terrible. Know. Terrible. It was terrible until the new rules came in. I was like 10 years old. I didn't really know. Like the, the, <laughs> I, I, I like I like the fact it's that like it's still the same. To summon Charizard. Yeah. <laughs> Is that what it was? Dude, Charizard had 120 attack power. You could kill anything with that thing. Basically. How much? Was anything gets knocked out. By How much that was Blast Second Blast? gen? Second gen was the. How much HP was Blast? Like Blast was at 100. 100. Yeah. Most. Most, most Pokemon had 100. Except Mewtwo, right? Yeah. Basically, YouTube probably had like 140 or something. Okay, so I'm gonna pause this. We're gonna be walking around. They're gonna be arguing right now, so I'm just gonna pause this and then we're gonna be walking around. Check out some more stuff. Yeah, so in, in celebration of this uh, kaijus and and like uh, Godzilla and stuff. Godzilla figures over here. We got Godzilla figures down here. So, that's great. So the thing is, is that majority of these figures are pretty, pretty on a pricier side, just because they are the original 2004, 2003 figures from uh, vinyl figures of Godzilla, you know, from Japan. So you know, it, it is. There's a lot of stuff to look at, at at these shows. So you know what? The thing is, right, Jalen? 
we gotta support local vendors, right? Yeah. Support the local vendors. Support uh, local nerdum. Nerd, nerd, local nerd. There you go. Lo local local nerdum. nerdum. Support NSQ team. That's you. Nerds of the square table. <laughs> no, so, no, but but yeah. We're so gonna, we're gonna be looking we're around. Gonna be we're going around. to a lot of these events during the year. Yeah. Um, I know we missed coverage of QuaiCon and a couple other ones, but we're gonna try to get to every single whatever comic, anime, whatever it has to do with yeah. geeking out and everything. Yeah, and then we're just gonna be doing regular vlogs like something. this if we're allowed to. And you know, I don't think we're allowed to on this one, but we, I don't give a shit. Whatever they, they'll they'll say whatever they want. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> whatever. Okay. We'll, yeah, we'll do it until they say something. All right, <laughs> let's let's go walk around some more and then find something. Okay, so we just came around the corner and we're looking for more stuff to look at. And uh, basically, what they're they found right now is uh, some comic books. Uh, and this is sick. Like it's 125 bucks, but we got Legend Series Infinity Gauntlet uh, from Marvel. You know what kind of makes you sad, though? What is that? What, what, what was that? What was I trying to say? I guess you're not gonna have. I guess you'll have the opportunity to wear the fitting garments to the movies. But you can't. You can't wear the Thanos mask. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, because because of all the crazy uh, stuff that's been happening in movie theaters nowadays, um, you can't wear a Thanos mask. You can't wear any mask. You can't even cosplay. And that's just it, it. Just killed the vibe. Yeah, you know, with all these real, real stuff that's been happening. Like real tragedy. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff that you can't, you can't really do and now that anymore. Cosplaying is dying. <sighs> Cosplaying is fandom, but there is dying. So, <sighs> oh well. Well, hopefully, like in the future, uh, they're gonna make Marvel's gonna make uh, good movies or Disney's gonna make good movies. Mm -hmm. Just seeing that Infinity Gauntlet, like all the fans and stuff, when they go to the movies, you know, I don't know when is the, when when the era is gonna end. Of yeah. Just comic movies. But yeah, yeah. No, I think I think I like know. they have a pretty good like you know they're just gonna keep on producing, producing. I think their comic movies like they're gonna keep on producing. It's just that um, you know they're gonna be doing in, a lot of independent comics rather than rather than mainstream comics. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. you know so a lot like, of the like, unknown. Yeah, always like anti eras or like you know Lord of the Rings. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean they brought back Star Wars. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of sad. <laughs> you want it to keep going, but yeah. you obviously got it. Yeah. So, Gregatron, you found some pops. Yep. Which one are you most fond of? Just point to it. Oh, wow. Wow. Hell yeah. Would you go and buy it? Uh, no space. <laughs> no space. <laughs> no space. Okay, so we're continuing down the walk of, of craziness. So we got a bunch of pops left and right here at Hawaii Comic Con, I mean, comic, sorry, Hawaii Comic Con, Hawaii Comic Toy Expo. So this is like one of the one of the expos that we just started or that just started happening uh, about five years ago. Like as you know, as we said from the beginning, and yeah, basically we started this five five years ago, and now it's huge. It's big. It's like there's a lot of collectors nowadays. So you know, and everybody's proud to be collecting nowadays. Well, I'm trying to. Sorry. So what are we looking at, Jalen? Um, pops right now. I, it looks like they either moved stuff or like restocked or something. So yeah. I'm looking for some. Yeah. I'm looking for Pennywise. You looking for Pennywise? Yes. Okay. So all right, let me show you what what we're looking at. Be <laughs> <Need> more. Then 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 the only thing I think that would be super interesting for me would be Yeah, that's... So, like, so today, imagine. what day is it today? Uh, today you know, is you know what day it is. Today is Game of Thrones day. Yes. So, so we know that this guy, or spoiler alert, we know that this guy didn't make it. So... Oh, you're, I thought he's you said gonna be sitting, <laughs> he's gonna be sitting... Who's gonna be sitting on the throne? No one. Nice. We all know. Yeah, there will be no throw. Yeah, you know? Who do you think? Who do you think it is? That guy. Which one? Tyrion. Tyrion? <laughs> Tyrion? 
You mean Peter Dinklage? Yeah. The the South Pole Elf? <laughs> okay. That's what they mean. Alright, <laughs> All right, so she, I know she's not gonna walk around some more and talk stories and whatnot. She uh, Cersei ain't sitting on the throne. Yeah. We so we're, gonna, we're gonna go walk around some more. Hiking okay. gone. But so. hiking gone. Yeah, so, and we're gonna walk around some more. We gotta get a good Okay. So we're still walking around. Uh it's been how long has it been already? We've been here for Oh, Greg's been Greg has been been here like a long time. Yeah. So we've been here for a while. Yeah. <laughs> and then um but basically uh big question though, Jalen. Do you think these events like really helped out help out with uh you know like the future is youth yeah. and uh you know being especially, nerdy and coming out and especially uh like kids, you know that you know obviously in uh, like uh elementary school or something like that. Yeah. Like it's before like I don't know I guess if you liked gaming and yeah. you know, toys and whatnot, like you kinda before you're kinda look 